on a fishing trip. Yeah. So, mm-hmm. I was just making sure that was you. Thanks, man. Have a good night. Okay. Have a good night. Hold on. You measured water curving with a cell phone? Oh, and you owe me 20 bucks. Okay. Did I hear that correctly? You measured curving water on a fishing trip using your cell phone? I I measured that there were six feet, right? And I was three miles and I was three feet and I could not see the six foot dam from the surface of the earth. But there was a horizon line in the way, which I can only assume that there's some sort of assume something in the way there, right? Like if there's a line of something and there's an object in the way of it, when it should be a straight path, then what am I, what am I supposed to think then? This is glow. Real quick. You were, you were, how far, how far was that? The the camera above the water? Three foot. Three, Three feet. Could there have been a four foot wave? between you no nah, it was a relatively calm lake right. i don't think i don't think so i mean i mean maybe but i didn't see one did you see why, one are, the far side why are you where, whispering where you were looking for? i'm not sure why he's whispering oh, i'm inside now but did you you know all the waves on the other side of the lake and their height just i'm just curious if there was a four foot wave at well all. i mean it was it's only a it's only so big of a lake where I was looking. It was like about three point one miles from where I was standing to the to the dam. And if you're if you were standing straight up, right, like you could see the edge of the dam, and there didn't appear to be any waves. There was a, some small ripples because there was a very slight breeze. There was nobody on the water at the time because none of the boats had come out of uh, winterization yet, and they pulled the boats off the lake. Because so are you saying there was a drop? Oh, sorry, I thought you were finished. I am. So are you saying there was a drop of water there? No, I'm saying there was a whole lake of water there. Yeah, but what what was causing the obstruction of the dam? Uh, the water, the horizon, uh, was uh, obstructing the dam. The horizon is the apparent junction where the sky meets either the ground or the water. Correct. Are you saying an apparent, an apparent location was blocking the dam? Is that what you're saying? Yes, that's correct. And something apparent was blocking something. Yes, apparently it was blocking it, yes. So do you realize what you're saying, right? Yes, I'm saying apparently the horizon was blocking the dam. So was it the was it the water or was it the sky? Or well, the water would be the, point? the water would be in the same section as where the dam would be. So I'm going to call it the water was blocking the dam. So there was well, a hump of be water a between. That's a hump. Yeah, there was a hump of water between you and the dam. Is that that's what you're claiming? Mm, no, I think. I think there's oh. water there and that there was a tangent from my line of sight to the dam that I could not see the dam. That would I be was a hump, running sir. into the I was running into the water. That would be a hump. That would definitely so, be a hump. The water would that, be higher. I wouldn't call that a hump. Higher. I mean, I, a hump would be something that would be off of level. So like I I don't think that it was raised further than water level, right? Like it's it's What's the same level the whole way the across. If the dam is think six what they foot, mean is that three foot, there's got to be something yeah, higher. I, I think the way I was looking, right, was making a tangent through the water because there was an arc there. I don't think there was a hump of water. Yeah, but it would be a hump from that tangent, wouldn't it? Like uh, the the straight no. line, your the, the tangent. Okay. No, the the water's the same level. It's the same height the whole way across. No, yeah, but that's um, not. A... It, it's not a hump. No, um. Yeah, Are if you you're sure? comparing to level, if if you're comparing to level, and the water's level all the way, of course it's, it wouldn't be a hump because you're comparing to level. But if you're compared to well, the straight line second. you're referring to, 
You got that would a be a hump, foot, wouldn't it? You got a six foot tall yeah. object in the distance, and you're only three foot above water, and you're saying the water is obstructing the six foot tall object. It would either have to be a hump or I don't know, maybe something else, or maybe some. Um, how, how far was it? Apparent, like you the said, three miles. Before. If if you have an arc, right, um, and then you look down through, like keep if you look at the top of the arc, and a tangent, right, and then you look down below the top of that arc. Oh, okay, I see a drop. You, a drop you're, call, you're calling that the whatever is above that tangent line from you and the object no, that you're you. trying to look at is a hump, confused. but I'm not calling it a hump. I'm just saying that it, it gradually arcs, right? And like, you're trying to look through it. That's not yeah, a hump. Yeah, I got that's, you now. That's yeah, you being you. dumb, trying to look through the fucking water. Your, your uh, ass let me ask you, what shape is an arc in, please, sir? An arc? It's a gentle curve. Like a hump? It could be. If you had a hump, you could say the outside of the hump is an arc of some sort yeah sure so an arc is something that has an apex and like two drops on either side correct uh or depending on your your reference frame so like you could be standing at one end well, of the arc yeah you're a three foot, and the arc the is camera. dropping below you and it never comes above you and so therefore there there would be nothing above we, you it would all be below it. you we have the reference yeah, but then it wouldn't be able to block it. anything would it well, it depends on which way you're looking. Like, so if you're trying to look down below, well, that way, the way that you just arc, described now, the way that you just then, described now, if it was going it down in that in that perspective, wouldn't be able to block anything, right? Lower than you, um, like um, you described in your scenario. Disagree? I, di I disagree. I think. Well, I well, think I disagree you, with you. You just described wow. it. Yeah. I think you're disagreeing with yourself. Um, no. Yeah, if, you're so. the, if you're the viewer and the water is dropping away from you at every point. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So it's a drop then. So Definitely if you a have a curve, it doesn't really matter where it it is in relation to you. If you attempt to look through it in a tangent, right, like through the, the, the arc, it's... All right obviously going to block your it's going to obstruct your view no matter where the end of it is it doesn't well that matter. would mean the dam has to be dropped it would be lower than the tangent is what you're saying that would be a drop drop from tangent um, if your eyes are looking three miles away and at some point the tangent line hits the top of the water and continues and goes over the dam but you can't see the dam that means the dam is lower than the tangent that's a drop. So is it drop? I mean, I think I you follow don't you. To, you don't have to give a final answer, but right it now it's a drop. drop. No, I, I mean, drop I think I follow you. I, I, I'm trying. I'm trying to understand the words that you're saying and make sure that I understand your meanings. Tangent, line of sight, drop from tangent. That yeah, I mean the water obstructing. If you say that I'm at the, at one end of the of the arc, right, and the dam is at the other end of the arc, and no, I that's can't... what you said. That's what you said. Well, I'm saying I'm just. Oh my god, why are you gonna be so pedantic? Look, okay, I I know that's what I said, but like words have meaning. If we if we say, or if I say, um, that the, that's what is there, and I can't see the dam. But I see this sort of obstruction of water in front of me. Then, I, I, I mean, what do you mean, the, sort of? Try to be precise with your terminology. I, Words. Well, have I can't meaning. because you're like the the way you're describing it is confusing me. Oh, I don't. You're describing I don't get, it. I can't sure. follow you. You're you're describing it. Yeah, you told right. us that's that's the only but way. I'm, we I'm trying to how. use your words. Like I'm trying to use your words in a way that no, use you, your words. Me. Use your words. Well, I did already. I told you like a million times. Like no, this is first, a very no, simple. Hold on. First, you said problem. it's. First, you said it's a, the apparent. You said something apparent is blocking the actual dam. 
And yes, then when I question you further, I said, are you sure? Is, blocking the is it the, the sky dam. or is it the water? Then you said the water, right? Yeah, the, wa the water is the, down below the horizon, right? Obviously, the, the horizon's being made by the water in the sky. I can't see below that horizon line, so therefore that, yeah, well, definitely, that definitely is hum, blocking, right? blocking the, the damn dam. That's definitely so there a has hump, to be of water. water between you and the dam blocking it, correct? Yeah, sure. a hump. Yes, it's not a hump, though. What is it? How would you describe it? It's just the water, right? Like, it's it's not a hump. I don't I don't understand this hump thing. Why are you saying a hump? Well, it's like, water is it's serving. Like a camel has a hump, right? Like, that's not what I'm talking about. Well, how would you explain it, then? How could something block your view between you and the dam if it's not the apparent by, we established first you said apparent then you corrected yourself fine then by, you said the water by 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 moving my eyes below the horizon um i am making a tangent through the water uh oh definitely so, a drop oh, now. that's uh, that's that's definitely a, whole a drop thing now yeah, yeah that's a drop now drop. Drop from tangent. the The dam is lower than the tangent of your eyes. That's definitely a drop, man. Uh, okay. Yeah, Have you heard the word dialetheism? Did I cut out there? No, my wife is yelling at me. Yeah, I understand. <laughs> We're just trying to dumb it down for you a little bit here, man. I, I thought you were going to give me a clip of that. No, I asked somebody else. I don't have time for that. 20 bucks, man. Make it 20 grand. Uh, when I'll have a when clip you said you. you owe me 20 bucks, I thought you had found it. Mm -hmm. I hook it up. I didn't find, but I didn't. Maybe I didn't went far back enough. Uh, yeah, was when he was talking to the other guy. Maybe it yeah, never happened. With Fuzzy. Uh, I went back till they were talking about the distance to the sun mm -hmm. from that on i didn't find it he's saying it it wasn't that far back from when i said it but if he wants to make it like 10 grand i'll find it but 20 bucks ain't worth my time i ain't got fucking 10 grand what the hell yeah i, I sell air compressor parts for christ's sake no nah, i understand sir completely i gave you as much money as i can give 20 bucks is a lot for me gotcha uh, how how high were you from the water when you were three feet? About three seeing? feet. It, it three was feet a three feet. Water? It was a three. It might have been a couple inches off, but it was a three feet tripod, like that, one of them, like just cheap plastic ones that have the three legs. It doesn't have an extension thing on it. It's just got right. a platform right. on the top that you can swivel it around and stuff. Right. He he used and a um auto. It's like uh, a backpack one. It's like one that you can carry in your pack. Right. He used a Theatlite app on his phone. The Theatlite app was three miles away from you, right? Yeah, it was like a crappy Theatlite app. I don't even know which one it was. Right, and it was six feet obstructed. I believe it was six feet. Yes, I I'm saying six feet. I'm pretty sure that I remember it being six feet. It could have been like five feet, maybe, okay. but I'm pretty sure it was somewhere close to six feet. I think. If, if that was the case, it was mostly uh, the, the mirage of the, the water, then... Yeah, it was definitely some refraction going on. You could see it in the picture. Yeah, because just the curvature it can't account for six feet. No. I don't... No, it definitely couldn't. I think it, I think the most it could account for was about two and a half feet. No, actually, it's zero. No. If, I mean, assuming a curvature, uh, if, you were, if, you, if your observation were from eye level, I mean, sorry, for, from from the level of the water, then you would have exactly six feet obstructing it. But if it was three feet above the water, then you would have to be would have to be less than that. I don't know exactly. Bacon right. to the rescue. So was it the water bacon that was blocking the view? Uh, I can't say. You can't say, but you thought you'd come in and talk numbers, right? Try to distract us from our conversation. Uh, he uh, said it was a mirage. He I'm said mirage. Saying it, 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 a mirage. It, I said that the curvature of the water can't account for six feet. So you at, at least would need uh, a mirage for that. Like a... it, No, it was some refraction. It, there was definitely... Um, uh, 
the temperature of the water was allowing for a refraction because it was a slightly oh, warm day, but the lake water right. is quite cool. He yeah, took the pontoon boat across the three miles and measured the water temperature and the air temperature along for, his optical corridor. That's for, what he told us earlier. For refraction to increase how much it's being obstructed, you need like uh, the the bottom the bottom of of the layers to be less dense than the upper. And if that happens, you're gonna have mirage because that doesn't extend for too long going up. So it flips, and when it flips, you you get twice the, the thing you're looking at. So, yeah, so not the water then, not the water. Definitely it's mirage. It's a mirage. Definitely mirage. Yeah, it, the, definitely there was okay. a refraction. Uh, I know uh, what I was looking at. There was no mirage. Were you there? That's what mm -hmm. I was just going to ask. Were you there, Bacon? Because you seem to be speaking for Damon here. With absolutely no, no clue uh, of what, what just, was going on on that day. Uh, can I have a second? Uh, I'm on just this trying topic. to make sense out of out of out of the observation that he's he's describing. Can I have a second with him on this? Um, what did you say? There's definitely there was definitely no mirage. You didn't see a mirage, Damon. Not a, not like you know not like an oasis mirage, like in a desert kind of thing. Yeah, there let me was, give you. Let me give you a couple was, definitions. There was a bit of I, distortion right at the uh, right at the horizon line. Oh, or like distortion. if you got lower, you could see like kind of like when you look at heat waves or whatever, you know, you could see that the the it yeah, was so flux, like a little bit of fluctuation. That's called like a that. mirage. Yeah, let me but, let me give you a um, couple of definitions if you don't mind. No, I ain't got time for that. I gotta go. I gotta go. Okay, no problem. I'll give the audience some definitions. Yeah, that's Mir fine. Mirage. We can talk later. Okay. Hey, see you later, man. Good luck on the, your sales. Thank you, uh, Damon. Yeah, thanks. Mm -hmm. Back again another time. Yeah, maybe tomorrow. Sure. Mirage. Sure. Maybe uh, later on the night when, um, you know. Oh, no, I, I got to go to bed. I got to get up for yeah, work. I she's pretty pissed. Yeah, I hear you. All right, for the audience, mirage. The definition of mirage is an optical illusion, something that you believe you see, but that isn't really there. Okay, that's one. Another one I found. People sometimes label a mirage as illusions or hallucinations. But maybe yeah. a mirage isn't either one. Illusions, illusions and hallucinations are products of the mind. But the physics of Earth's atmosphere causes a mirage. I like that one. There's another one. I mean, it just keeps going. An optical illusion caused by atmospheric conditions. Oh, man, that fits the this, this scenario, right? Yeah. Right. Something. In, in hang, on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. One more. Something mm. that appears real or possible, but is not, in fact. Wow. Those are pretty powerful definitions of mirages, don't you think? Thank you for your okay. time. Okay. I'll be here all night. Don't forget to tip your waitresses. Yeah, in the, in the context that we're talking about, which is refraction, it, it means something more specific than the general definitions you, you're going to find, I think. Right? Doesn't matter. It's either water blocking the dam or not water blocking the dam. And you can't, even if it's water, you can't have water both dropping and humping. So there's paradoxes here. There's no, there's no, all I, kinds of problems here with this scenario. I think the both statements you said were wrong. Like uh, it can be a combination of factors. It can be both the water and like atmospheric refraction, for example, which I would I would say was uh, was going on. Uh, but the without other being there, with wrong. him clearly telling you that it wasn't that. Clearly, uh, he said he didn't saw mirage, but he saw refraction. Uh, but I think my 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 reasoning was wrong. It doesn't. He doesn't have to know the difference. <laughs> the, uh, with all due respect, respect he, no, he doesn't know the difference. With all due respect. Wow, well, I guess we have to wait until he comes back to to know if he actually does or doesn't. All right. Or you could use your discernment on how he was speaking and how he was using it and say the same thing. Oh, okay. I, I, I'm not going to make that judgment. Anyway, the the second thing that you, you cannot drop and hump at the same time, well, the hump would be 
in respect to a chord line and the drop would be in respect to a horizontal line so they're not uh, it's not dropping and humping from the same line so there, there's no problem there what's blocking the dam i said i don't know i guess it's part of the curvature and part of the refraction so you're just guessing okay got it yeah i'm just guessing that'll be my okay. guess as long as that's established we're good Have you ever seen Earth Curve block anything, Bacon? Uh, no, me personally not. <laughs> you not just assume it does, huh? I'm not.